Hi, in this video I'm going to take you through some simple steps to take a printer with an offline status and change it to online. The advice offered here will range from the most simple solution for this problem to completely removing printer drivers and software, and is universal to nearly every modern printer. At the end of each section I would recommend checking your printer status to see if it has changed to online. First of all, we have some physical checks. Ensure that both ends of the USB cable are firmly inserted. If the printer is networked, then make sure the Ethernet cable is firmly inserted also. If you have additional USB ports available in your PC or laptop, then try the USB cable in these. If you own another USB cable, then try this cable in conjunction with your printer and computer. It's worth noting that if you own another printer, the USB cable will almost certainly have the same connections. The next step is to set the printer to online manually. First, go to the start icon on the bottom left of your screen, then choose control panel, and then devices and printers. Then, right click the printer in question and select see what's printing. From the window that pops up, choose printer from the bar at the top. Select use printer online from the drop down menu. You can now double click your printer from devices and printers and hopefully see the status as ready. Next, we will remove any pending print jobs. From the see what's printing menu mentioned previously, right click cancel on any print jobs present. With the print jobs removed, select Use Printer Online again. If any stubborn print jobs remain, then try restarting both your PC and printer. Next, we're going to try removing and reinstalling your printer. First, right click the printer from Devices and Printers and select Remove Device from the drop down menu. Now, add the printer again by selecting the Add a Printer option from Devices and Printers. Lastly, we're going to try removing drivers and software packages from the PC completely. First, make sure you are using Windows as an admin or sign in as one. Now go to Start, All Programs, Accessories, and then Command Prompt. With Command Prompt open, type Print UI space forward slash S space forward slash T 2. Be sure to include the spaces. Now hit Enter and this will open the Print Server Properties window. You can now remove the driver and package for the printer in question. You can now add your printer again by selecting Add a Printer from Devices and Printers. If, after following all of these steps, your printer is still not online, there is likely to be an issue with the printer electronically, and I would advise contacting the printer's manufacturer or a printer technician. Thank you for watching, I hope you found this guide useful. If you've got anything to add or have any other questions, please let us know in the comments below.